Okay, our room's looking pretty good, but we still need to put a wall around this internal piece here. To do that, we're going to use the circle tool. I'm going to purposely make a mistake just to show you a couple of new features, and then we'll go back and redo it correctly. So click on the circle tool. Start in the middle of your circle, draw out to one of the edges, and you can see we've now got a circle in the middle. Unfortunately, it's a big bright red circle fully enclosed. What we really want is just the wall to be drawn along the edges. Use the undo function here to get rid of that. In order to make the circle draw correctly, just a wall around here, we can reset some of these top controls along here. This is the fill style. So we'll start by not having it just fill in bright red. Click on the fill style and you'll see that we've got brush patterns here and currently we've got solid selected which is why we're getting a solid red background on that circle. We don't want that. Come over to bitmap files, scroll down the list of fill style names until you find all cobble brown. Click on OK. The next thing that we want to do is make sure that the line is set to solid. So this is a solid line style. If you click on that you'll see that you can actually select all sorts of different dotted lines and so forth. We won't go into that at the moment because we just want it on solid. Now, very important, change the layers. If we draw this on the floor layer it's going to be difficult to edit. So click on this and we'll change it to walls. Again, clicking in this button here will select the walls. You can now see we've got walls selected. Finally, so that this will draw a line, not an entirely filled shape, you want to change the width, the line width, to another number. Now our walls are currently half a foot thick, so we'll make them 0 0.5 feet. Click on OK. We're now ready to redraw the wall. Oh, no we're not. One more thing, very important. You must make sure that the sheeting effect is also applied to walls. Otherwise the special effects applied to this will be quite different. As you can see we have a, a bevel and, and inner and outer glow. Okay, let's now draw this. Start in the middle, draw to the outside, we're done, refresh, and you can see you've got a nice inner wall. 